Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's Mike, KD2KOG, part of the technical support staff here at SDRplay.com. I'm going to shoot a live video from the vehicle. Now, here is the patch antenna from SDR Kits. I have it roughly pointing at 217 degrees, which would be southwest for the Inmarsat satellite that I would like to pick up. So it's sitting here on the roof of my car. There's a great ground plane right here. Here's a patch antenna. Let me pause this video, and we'll go inside the vehicle and see what we're picking up. Okay, we're inside the vehicle. Let me zoom out of the spectrum a little bit. Sorry for the quality of this video. I have to do this using my mobile phone, so let me zoom out. And you can see I'm picking up quite a few Inmarsat stations here, uh, Inmarsat signals, uh, starting at 145, uh, 1545. So let me zoom in a bit. Now, using the frequency list from uh, SATCOM, I'm filtering by VRX, within the SDR UNO memory panel is telling me it's Inmarsat 3 F2, uh, F2 or F3 arrow, and I'm on that frequency, and let me bring Jero up, and we'll take a look. And it's decoding here. So let's move a little further up the band, and let's see what we get over there. It'll probably be this signal over here. All right, Inmarsat 3 F2 arrow, uh, 600. So let's take a look. Let's clear this out. Make sure we're on. And we have data coming in. And let's see if we get a plane. And here's a plane. Let's make this a little bit bigger. And we'll watch this for a little bit. And as I said, my apology for the quality of this video, but just to show you that this does work, I'm using a Celeron laptop, Lenovo IdeaPad, I believe it's one, the model number is 121, it's a $100 laptop, uh, and it's working fine. So let's see if we get any more, there's a second plane, and let's see what airplane that is, that's an Airbus A330-202, the owner is High Fly. let's see what the first message was. This is Air Europa, and let's see if we get a third plane. Here's a third one coming in, and that one actually sent the message. Now, due to the nature of this decoder and certain laws and privacy, I'm not going to display that message because I don't know if it goes against my local laws or I don't want to infringe on any law. So use this decoder uh, properly, and please follow your local laws when it comes to privacy. And it's just spewing out tons of data as you guys can see here. So let me just show you SDR Uno. And it's right over here, and I'm getting a signal DB. Let's see, let's just tighten this up a little bit. Uh, SNR, 10 DB, 9.6 to 10. Plenty fine for decoding these ACARS messages over in Marset using the SDR kits patch antenna. Like I said, model number here, I'm going to plug it again because this antenna is phenomenal. A154 from sdrkits.net. All right, I'll see you guys in the next video. Let's see what kind of stuff I can pick up and let's further explore this Inmarsat decoding. I'll see you guys in the next video. 73 for now.